heart and soul of the game is at the boxing voice. Ain't no other sight in the game to see the boxing voice. Sean Zatel, the boxing voice here with champion of the world at 140 pounds, one of the best young guys in boxing, Jesse Vargas. What's up, Jesse? What's up, John? I'm Sean. I'm sorry, man. Um, man, uh, it's nice having you back in the, uh, in the gym, you know, talking with you. And here we are again, getting ready for another big fight in training camp. And we're, we're excited to, to get it started. I'm here again, and it's always great to be here, but I... I already felt a lot more intensity from you heading into this fight, and this is just, uh, I think, your second week of training. You're fighting Tim Timothy Bradley. He's he's one of the best fighters in the sport. What does this mean to you heading into the fight? It means a lot, man. I mean, this is the biggest fight of my career so far, and I'm excited to to get this opportunity. Now I'm gonna I'm planning on taking full advantage of it. As you said, there is some intensity. I mean, we've been in camp officially about two weeks, right? This is the second week now, but we've been preparing for it a few months back already because we knew that this this opportunity was going to come. Uh, either Bradley or Brandon Rios. I, the, most we had our eye on Bradley because my manager had told me, "What do you think of Bradley? You, you want you want to fight with Bradley?" I said, "Yeah, I want to fight with Bradley. Give me anyone with the big name." He said, "I'm gonna work on Bradley," and he got it. So when he said that a few months back, I said, "You know what? Let's start preparing. Let's start getting ready. The fight might be June 6th. The fight might be uh, June 12th." So that's what we were throwing it at, you know, and... Um, wound up on the 27th. Wound up on the 27th, but uh, that got confirmed not too long ago, but we stayed ready, you know, we kept the weight down. As soon as it was confirmed for June 27th, we took a few days off, and now we're here, back at it, so we're ready, man. I mean, I can't, I can't wait. It's going to be a great fight. It's going to be a great victory for me. I mean, this... This big, would be the biggest, man. Exactly. It would take us to a whole nother level. Give me all the respect that I need from all my fans. Yeah, yeah. Man, I can't wait. You know, they're going to have a good night. Have you already, were you already breaking down tapes of Tim? Because, uh, I mean, I know you've seen him fight. You guys have fought on the same card. You, you've been his co-main event. Now you fight him in the main event. What do you think of him as a fighter? I like him, man. He's a good fighter. He's a good, uh, tricky fighter. He has a little bit of an awkward style, but, but uh, nothing that, that I can't figure out. I've seen him fight several times. Man, I, I remember him fighting Abrigo, and, and I was like, man, I want, why don't I, I want that shot. You know, I want to fight him. Now it's here. You know, uh, and I was just a puppy back then, man. I was just 21, I think, man. So now I get to prove that what I said before was was true and that I could take him on, and, and I will show you that. You know, I will become the new WBA, uh, WBO world champion and WBA junior world weight champion. Two divisions. That'd be 140 and 147 at the same time, so... That's right, man. Thankfully, uh, I want to give th big thanks to my family from WBA that are giving me the chance to move up and wait for this fight and, and, and take on this opportunity. Man, and being a world champion in two divisions doesn't sound bad at all. Now, you know, you, the, you guys both have a lot of great skills. You, you have the height advantage and a great jab, and Tim can box. He's proven that by outboxing Juan Manuel Marquez. But one thing that's special about Bradley that, that, that people say is his heart. He'll, he'll fight through anything to, to try and get the victory. I think that you have that as well. Are you, are you trying to show people that as well come fight night that I know Bradley has all this will and all this heart, but I can match it? That's right, Sean. That's it. I mean, not so much I can match it. I can match it and above that much more. You know what I mean? Let me show you who, who I am. You know, uh, that's the reason why I'm looking forward to this fight because I know I, I have a lot of respect for, for Tim because I know the fighter he is. I know how he carries himself. And he, uh, he leaves it on the ring no matter what. He doesn't give up. And I like that. You know, because every time you have that, two fighters that have that same, that same, uh, same attitude. Style, same attitude. Man, it's, uh, it makes it for a great fight, without a doubt. And I'm not giving up. You know, he's not going to try and give up, but I'm going to make him. <laughs> you know, you, you guys both have that heart and, and, and uh, the style that, that usually makes for a great fight. He's always...